and welcome back. When reporting to your senior management of your project, you should use a milestone chart or a milestone schedule. The detailed schedules of your projects are for the technical people or your project team, while the senior management and other senior stakeholders on the project only want to see the progress achieved till the date. So this is why we use milestone charts in order to report to them and show them the progress that each milestone has achieved. In today's video, I am going to show you a dynamic version of project milestone chart using Microsoft Excel. As you can see in this chart, I have five milestones. And if I change the dates of any of the milestones, the dynamic chart should be updated as well. For example, let's make this 1st of August 2022. I'll write down 1st of August 2022. As you can see, the milestone moved to the right. And let's make this, for example, 28th of October 2022. So I'll write down 28th of October 2022. The milestone will move. So let's get started and let me show you how to prepare such dynamic milestone in some easy steps using Microsoft Excel. In here, we have the milestone name and the date that the milestone will be achieved. The new thing that you might notice in here is the position. This shows the vertical location of each of the milestones on the chart. So for example, if I have 10 milestones in my project, I'll start for number 10, which means that the milestone number 1 will be located at y equals to 10. And it will continue to the milestones downward. Number 2 will be at 9, number 3 will be at 8, and so on. The first step is to select the dates and the positions. Then we will go to insert, and from here we will insert a scatter diagram. I will resize this chart a little bit and move it downwards. Next we are going to remove the chart title. I will remove the vertical and the horizontal lines from here. And I will remove this axis. Next thing is to change these round shapes to diamonds which will represent a milestone. To do that, I will right click on these and go to Format Data Series. From Fill and Line in here, I will select the marker and for the marker options, I'll go to built-in, and from here, I'll select a diamond shape. I can increase the size from here if I wanted to. Next thing is to add data labels to the milestones. I'll right-click again and go to Add Data Labels and click Data Labels. So the data labels in terms of their positions will be added in here. I want to have the names in here. So I'll right-click on the data labels in here and go to Format Data Labels. From here, I'll select values from cells, and the source for these values should be this range, and click OK. And I will uncheck the Y value. I'll close this. Now, as you can see, if I update the dates of any of them, for example, let's make it 1st of July, it will move backwards. So this is how you can prepare dynamic milestone charts using Microsoft Excel. If you like the content of the video, consider subscribing to the YouTube channel for more useful content about project management. In addition, consider visiting our Instagram and LinkedIn pages. Thank you very much for watching.